Reports to topvelocity.net. Going to do a pitching, pitching analysis here. Scott going to pair him up with Cody Hall. Take him just out of leg lift, both getting inside drive legs. You see him both shifting inside drive leg well. Let's take him to just before leg drive. Now we see Scott here, you're working on flat ground. But if we get him just before leg drive, you can see Cody, great job of staying close. You can see Scott already starting to open up. You see because of that back knee turning down, Cody's holding torsion, counter rotating trunk. So I think Scott, you got to learn how to, and it looks like you have some tight hips or you could just be loading into your quad here, but you need to learn how to sit into your hip, counter rotate the hips, keep the front side closed, even learn to counter rotate the trunk like Cody's doing. Because Cody's going to get farther down the 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 or down the mound or um, you know I know you're flat around here but the same things farther through his stride before he opens so you can see here you're already opening and you're already cocking because everything's going to go early with you when you delay rotation you're you have more time to build linear energy the earlier you rotate the 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 kinetic uh, the kinetic sequences start to go so you're not at that point, you're multiplying potential energy. You're not creating it. So the longer we can take create it, then we have more energy to transfer through the kinetic chain. So you can see Cody does a real good job with that. So late, he opens and drives. So now he's got way more potential energy at front foot strike than you. And also that, he's staying more close still. Lift leg is closed. Shoulders are closed. You can see at front foot strike, when your front foot goes all the way down, your front foot is, is, even though it's closed position, it's still open uh, in its orientation. Also, too, your your, your trunk is open um, because you started opening early. So when we open early, we're going to be more open at front foot. That means we're going to be uh, quicker in the movement of transferring energy, and we're going to be quicker to release. So we're not going to potentially build as much energy. So you can see very quick to release with you, even though you, you carried your trunk forward. You can see Cody later to release has more energy through more hip to shoulders. I mean, to transfer due to more hip to shoulder separation. And you see all that forward trunk and everything get over the front side. So you see, and you see more hip abduction than you. So we know more energy. We know later transfer of energy and we see more forward trunk, uh, or more abducted hip with the forward trunk over front foot, which we know more potential energy got into the ball. So. It's just learning how to delay rotation for you is going to be key in building more power before rotation, maximizing hip-to-shoulder separation. These are going to be really key concepts for you as you go through the program.